Troops TV, presented by Barstool Sports. We're on to the player rating segment. Uh, it was 1-0 to, to Man City in the FA Cup fourth round at the Etihad. Uh, let's start with our man in Gates, who I thought did pretty well today. Matt Turner. Yeah, man, I thought he'd done pretty well today as well, blood. You get me? I think he claimed he, he, he commanded his box well. You understand? We needed to punch, he punched. We needed to claim, he claimed. His kicking was on point. You get me? The goal, he got put in a spliff. You understand? It weren't his fault. You get me? It was a good finish from Ake. Even though it was on Ake's wrong foot, it was still a good finish. So, you get me? I give Matt Turner a seven today. All right. On to left back. Uh, Kieran Tierney was playing left back. Kieran, I give a six. You get me? Um, He needed to do more blood going forward. You get me? Like... Trossard was doing so much down that wing, but he was doing it all by himself, blood. He never had support. You get me? Like, you see Zinni up and down that flank with Martinelli. You understand? Overlapping Martinelli, coming inside to help Martinelli. Trossard was kind of out there by himself. Tierney didn't really back the thing today. You get me? Defensively, he was on point. You understand? But offensively, he was poor today. Six. But he was better than average. So that's why he's getting a six. All right, on to the center backs. Uh, let's start with Gabriel. Gabriel, I will give a seven. Um, I don't think he did anything wrong today, blood. You get me? He done really well. He won his jewels. You get me? He never got spun. You understand? No qualms with Gabriel today, blood. Been one of our best defenders all season. Seven. Uh, his partner today, Rob Holding. Holding gets a five. It was an average performance from Holden. It wasn't Holden. You get me? I was begging for the Diego Costa performance blood. You get me? But I was asking for too much blood. You understand? And Arteta knew himself when he went onto a yellow card. It was, you know what I mean, risk assessment now, blood. You get me? He is a high risk. We got to take this nigga off, bro. Because you get me? In, in the North London derby that cost us top four last season, that while I'd got sent off blood, you get me? And that's why we brought in my Polish brother because he's suspect at the back blood, you get me? So, five for holding. Uh, on to right back, Tommy Asa. Tommy Asa, I'll give a six as well. Um, defensively, you get me? The goal, I don't really blame him for the goal blood because he's tracked Grealish, he stayed with Grealish, he can't defend against two men. Two people. Do you understand? Yeah. He done someone, his, someone needs yeah, to tuck in. He, exactly. He's dealt with his defensive duties, bro. You get me. So six for Tommy, Brad. On to midfield, uh, Partey started. Partey, I give a seven. When he was on, doing his job, you get me. We were controlling the game, controlling the midfield. The first half was a very good first half. City offered nothing. You get me. They were going long to find Haaland. We had the better goal-scoring opportunities. Partey and Jacko were controlling the midfield. No problems with Partey. Another good performance. Seven. Uh, Granite Xhaka. Granite Xhaka as well. He'll get a seven as well, blood. Didn't put a foot wrong today. Um, he was part of creating one of our best chances in the game, the Eddie and Ketty, a chance in the second half. Um, he's been... Fantastic all season, blood. You get me. And no qualms with Xhaka today. Seven. Uh, right. On to the attackers. Let's start with Leandro Trossard. Trossard, for me, shared man of the match with uh, Matt Turner. Trossard gets a seven. Um, very good debut. Um, he done well for the hour that he was on. Second half, he didn't really get the ball enough because the team level dropped. We lost the midfield battle because that Walad Lokonga went in. So Trossard wasn't seeing the ball as much. But in the first half, he was a big, big factor, creating chances down the left-hand side, tracking back, doing really well. Very happy with that signing, bro. You get me. Um, very disappointed to see him come off. But yeah, big up Trossard on his debut, his starting debut, because he made his debut against the other piece of shit Manchester team. Seven for Leandro. Through the middle, Fabio Vieira. He gets a four. You get me. 
did nothing, bro. You understand? He was just a passenger all game. Um, literally, the man was supposed to be playing in the creative hole behind the strikers. Donny's playing on the fucking right hand side, blood. He's not even staying in his position, bro. You get me? Offered nothing for. And then the other flank, uh, Bukayo Saka. Bukayo, blood clot Saka, my brother. Let's get that in every time. But today, probably your poorest performance in an Arsenal shirt. I don't know if it's to do with tiredness. I don't know if you was holding back. But today, you did nothing, bro. You get me? You should have been the first man substituted. You could have got substituted before holding. That's how bad it was today from Bakayo, bro. You get me? He could have got sub before holding, blood. So, you get me? Ever and away next Saturday, I'm expecting a big performance from Bakayo, blood. I expect him to bounce back. I want him to bounce back. I'm not turning on him, but over on Troops TV, you get honest analysis and Bakayo gets a four, blood. Then up front, uh, Edin Ketia. In Ketty, I'll give a six. He done well with, with his link-up play. Him and Trossard were linking up well. When the ball was going long, he was doing well to hold it up. He lost a few battles because he's up against two big seasoned Premier League centre-backs. But he done well today, bro. You get me? The only thing I was disappointed with was the chance that he got. I think he should have done a bit better than... I think he should have done a bit better with it. But in Ketty, he done good today, bro. You get me? No hate on Eddie. But you get me? He weren't as... He went at a Trossard... Or he went at a Trossard, Gabriel Turner level. You feel me? He was just under, so six. All right. On to the guys that came off the bench. Uh, Saliba came off the bench. Saliba, I'll give a seven, like Gabriel. Um, didn't put a foot wrong. You get me? Won his jewels. Came on and kept Harlan quiet. You get me? If he started, we probably would have flipping drew at least. You get me? So, yeah, seven for Willow. Uh, Sabi Lukonga? He gets a five. It was an average performance from him. You get me? He done what he usually does, just runs around the pitch, keeps it sideways, doesn't do nothing extravagant, gets caught way up the pitch when we're on, and then when we're getting broken on, positioning all over the place. Typical Sambi Lukonga, typical Sambi Lukonga performance, five. Uh, Zinchenko? Zinchenko, I give a six. He was trying to make things happen down the left-hand side, but City were doubling up on him because City know how to deal with him. You get me? They know what his, what his threats are. They know his capabilities. And you get me? He didn't, he didn't really have the chance to show what he's capable of doing. So, yeah, six for Zinni. Uh, Martinelli? Six for Martinelli as well. He came on, he brought life to the... Actually, you know what? I'm going to give Martinelli a seven, bro. You get me? Because he came on and he brought life to the team. You get me? Maybe that's that Trossard signing and the performance of Trossard when he came on against United and his performance in the first half. Maybe that's put a rocket up Martinelli's ass, blood. Pause that you've been asking for. Because when he came on, he had a bonnet in it. He had a bee in his bonnet, blood. You get me? He was causing problems down that left-hand side. He was getting in behind Walker. He had Walker on absolute ropes, bro. Let's have it right, blood. Yeah, yeah. he had Walker on ropes, bro. Yeah. That's why I was saying, Twice, three, why three. is he bringing a fucking Trossard when Trossard can play across the whole fucking front line, take off Saka, put Martinelli on, move Trossard to the right, Martinelli on the left. We could Maybe we could have come back in the game, blood. Saka did fuck all even when he got left on. He got pulled off, blood. You get me? So, seven for Martinelli. And then lastly, uh, Martin Odegaard. Odegaard didn't have enough time to do anything. You get me? You got brought on with 10 minutes to go. Not enough time. You're going to have to give him a standard five. All right. Then uh, the manager. You see me yeah, now because we had, because we've got so much time before our next game, I wouldn't have played holding blood. I wouldn't have played Fabio Vieira. The only change I would have made would have been Ramsdale for, for um, Turner. You get me? Ramsdale would have had a rest. And then obviously it's the cup, so you put your you put your second goalie in. You get me? Otherwise, I would have gone full strength. I personally believe if we went full strength, we could have beat City tonight. We could have beat City tonight if we went full strength, bro. You get me? So, you understand? He's done fantastic this season. 
This is the lowest rating that I'm going to give him this season. I'm going to give, I'm going to have to give Arteta a four blood because he also made the wrong changes. You get me? He took off Trossard and left Saka on. Fabio Vieira lasted, Fabio Vieira lasted 90 minutes, bro. How the fuck has he lasted 90 minutes, bro? It, I cannot believe that shit. You get me? So Arteta's got to, you understand, be man enough to admit that you fucked us tonight, bro. You get me? You're starting 11 and especially your changes because you could have rectified it. If you kept on Trossard and put on Martinelli and took off, a, and took off Saka, maybe we could have, something could have happened. We could have got a replay, which I, I thought, I thought, I thought, I thought that, I thought that was going to happen. It was going to be a draw. It was looking like it was going to be a draw until the Congo and them fucking idiot come on. But we've got to give Arteta a four today. Yeah, for me, for me, it was mainly the changes that really pissed me off about Arteta. But lastly, um, the the, the ref, the referee can go suck his sour mother for a straw blood. You get me? Like for Zinchenko to come on the pitch and get a yellow card, it just shows you the corruption is in full effect, blood. Yeah? And them fucking Abu Dhabi, man, their money long, blood. The man, they just drop it to Paul Tierney. The pussy was smiling and laughing, blood, when he made the yellow card. The, the, the Donny's laughing, bro. I done said it in the watch along, bro. If I wasn't married, I would fuck his daughter if she's legal in front of him, bro. Do you understand? Man, I give a rass, dog. Yeah? Man, I give a rass, blood. Yeah? Minus one blood clot million. All right, that's the player rating segment for uh, the FA Cup fourth round. We're out of it, unfortunately. Man City 1-0, uh, Nathan Ake, Nathan Ake goal. And yeah, we're out of the we're out of the FA Cup. Now the focus solely remains on the two, two competitions we have left, the Europa League and the Premier League. But Troops TV, presented by Barstool Sports, player ratings will be back again for the Everton game. Till then, peace, we're out.